I will trust in the Lord. I will try in the Lord. I will trust in the Lord till I die. Oh, yeah. I will trust in the Lord. I will trust in the Lord. Y'all remember that song? I will trust in the Lord till I die. Hey, you know what? I, I'm, I'm singing that. Because I, I'm i telling you, I hate to say this, Jennifer Hudson, no disrespect. But, you know, I'm still watching Cynthia Arrivo's uh, genius, Aretha Franklin. Oh, God, I think it was so well done. Not that Cynthia Arrivo was such a great actor a actress. I wish they could have put Jennifer in that movie as opposed to the script that was written for Respect. But that's how it goes. But Courtney B. Vance being playing Reverend C.L. Franklin was too much for me. I will trust. He reminds you of any jack leg preacher in the law till I die. I'm going to treat everybody right. That boy was something else. Uh, anyway, Courtney, shout out to Courtney V. Vance, who did an excellent job in that movie. Uh -huh. Damn, genius. Aretha Franklin. Uh, so I just had to give that, uh, um, that movie a shout out because I'm still watching it. And my Lord have mercy. It was just that good. For me, it was just that good. Okay, I can um, stop stalling time now. And today, I just want to speak to my Caucasian listeners just for a minute. Those of y'all racist that's out there, I know because some of y'all send me the emails or you leave a comment um, on some of these videos that you really hate that I do. But, you know, I really want to ask y'all, have you ever saw the movie... Cotton Comes to Harlem. If you haven't, I suggest that you, it, you know, if you can stomach watching a whole all black movie. It's actually kind of funny. It's got Godfrey Cambridge in it and Raymond St. Jocks and um, it's and Red Fox. In fact, it was his first role. It was about this bale of cotton that came to Harlem. Okay, and um, they was looking for this bale of cotton because this bale of cotton had some treasures in it. And it had been through a whole lot. Watch the movie. I don't want to give you the spoiler. And for anybody else who haven't saw it. But this is especially for my Caucasian listeners. At the end of this movie, there is this real charismatic leader, uh, preacher, Calvin Lockhart is who the actor is, who used to, I hate the name drop like this. Who used to go, who used to kick it with one of my friends and Gary? That's how dude was too deep. God bless the dead. He's uh, gone now. He was a a Trinidadian, I think. Where was he from? Or Grenada? One of those places. He was from one of those islands. Um, but he fell in in love with a friend of mine. Okay. In fact. It was a mess. But anyway, I'm going to go on. I, rest in peace, Calvin Lockhart. He was Reverend Deke O'Malley. Reverend Deke O'Malley is Donald Trump. <laughs> but the people had listened to him so long, so long, so long. They were under Deke O'Malley's spell. Deke O'Malley could do any damn thing he wanted to, and he could do no damn wrong. 
That's who Deke O'Malley was. And the people knew it. They loved him. They was willing to commit all kinds of uh, robberies or whatever he needed them to do. They would do it for Reverend Deke O'Malley. But there was these two detectives that knew better. They knew he was a, a, a shyster, a jack leg, and a snake charmer. And that was Godfrey and his partner. I'm not going to give you all the spoilers for those of y'all who haven't saw it. And it's very old, so you should have saw it by now. But this, again, most black people have saw it. They mama done saw it or they granddaddy, whatever. But for you white people who haven't saw it, who haven't seen it, I should say. Um, <laughs> look at it. Who have not seen it. It is Donald Trump warmed over. And at the end, the people got tired of the same lies, warmed over and over and over and over. And it was, reminds you of the emperor's new clothes. So I believe that Donald Trump's days is numbered because y'all can't be that damn stupid. I know some of y'all are really, really low on the Richter scale. I mean, extremely low. And yo, it ain't that much oil in y'all lamps. But I'm going to tell you, this here, Deco Malley, Donald Trump. Deco Malley, Donald Trump. Same thing. Let's just hope it ends the same way for Donald Trump. Y'all tell me if y'all seen Cotton Comes to Harlem. I want to know how many out there have seen it. Please leave your comments below. <laughs> y'all know I'm, if you like what you hear, like, subscribe, share, share the channel. Please hit the notification bell because you know what? YouTube is not allowing you know, the notifications to come through. It's also taking my subscribers. But that's neither here nor there. Because I just like talking to y'all. Keep going. I'll see you in the next video.